I'm Stephen Mitchell, the, the lad's father. I've lived here all my life, I've farmed um, here all my life and uh, this pile was put in when I left school back in 1974. It did serve its purpose, I say the first 20 odd years, it did a very good job. But say the last 10 or so, it's just been on its last, well last, especially the last five years, and it's on its last legs really. It was taking like nine, ten hours then, uh, milk in a day like, so you know, there's only me and Tom, we had the odd relief milk or whatever, or it's still, you know, one of you was tied up for ten hours. Because with the old bank, they weren't really interested in helping us put a new one in, so that's when Oxbury come out and they were dead easy, approachable. So, so I was approached by the Mitchell family a couple of years ago when I started with Oxbury. Um, at that time it was just a refinance and I sort of came out, met with them, had a look around and it was quite obvious at the time you know, what they wanted to do, but they were kind of tentative to do it because they just hadn't had that support from their existing bank at the time. She straight away said, you need a new pile, this can't carry on. Which, we'd asked the old bank before um, about doing a new parlour, and he sort of shoved it aside a bit, he wasn't really interested. Um, didn't really have a clue about what it would cost. You could tell that from what he, the way he was talking about it. Mel, when she came out, she said, oh, you need a new parlour. Um, and straight away said it'll be a big investment, the amount of money that it would be, um, which we, that was gives a lot of confidence. It was like, oh yeah, you can see she really knows what she's talking about. Um, for me, it was very obvious. And working for a bank that understands agriculture, you know, I could go back to our credit team and say, look, yeah, we're doing the refinance now, but in 12, 18 months' time, the next thing that these guys need to do is really to invest, and that's the way that they're going to be able to improve. And not only will it improve, you know, the financial returns, but their family life and work-life balance, which is so important. Well, you can see the difference straight away in the from the old one. The light in the air. Yeah. Like, yeah. Like, you do even notice in the afternoon sometimes when you start milking. Yeah, but you have the lights off. Yeah. It's a lot nicer than working as well. Yeah. There's more room for people in there. Cows were coming in. Mm -hmm. They run out of the shed to get in this parlour. Whereas the old parlour, they wouldn't. <laughs> yeah. In the morning now, we can be done for half seven, can't we? Yeah. Milking before it was like 10 o'clock. And I suppose you've got yeah. time now to go through the cows. Exactly, yeah. Do, do, do a job site. Yeah. yeah. And just sitting around the kitchen table chatting to her, you could tell that. She was very in touch with dairy farming and farming in general. She was just very, very easy to talk to and understood it. I mean, for me, I always come into it. Any customer, I want to know their story and I want to get to know them as people and what they, what drives them um, to, you know, get up in the morning, why they want to be in the industry and that sort of thing. A lot of the feedback that I get is that, firstly, they don't know who to contact and they haven't actually had somebody come out on farm. So for me. If all I have to do is drive 20 minutes down the road to go say hi, you know, it's, you know, I can do that, it's easy, it's not that much out of my day, um, and it's why I do the job. We put the new parlour in, we started it in 22, um, and eventually we started milking it off through this like, last month, and yeah, it's just changed our lives really, like. Uh, transformation to our life is fantastic, like, we can, we finished, we can finish two hours earlier at night, um, so we've got, our lifestyle is a lot better, we can go off doing different things, and just enjoying life more. You can you get finished in the morning three hours early than what we were before. It makes fair fair change like to well just your daily routine really like you get more done. We kept better for the cows as well. The cows are just so much happier. Going forward, um, now we've done the parlour, we want to keep expanding. We just bought another 150 cows, which they've come this week. Um, so there's two more sheds going up for them. Uh, going forward we want to keep expanding with the Oxbury by our side, I think that's definitely going to be possible. This is actually the first time I've seen it today. I think the big thing for me is just seeing the change in the family and their demeanours. You know, you can just tell just how much of an impact that it's had. So it's, yeah, it makes, it really does warm my heart, to be honest, because it is all for the right reasons.